This game is T and is not suitable for kids. Hey there, buddy! <laughs> not all of the colossi I have slayed have had a weird shadowy figure standing over me. Only most of them. Okay, we're starting off strong. That was a great fight. That was a great fight. I enjoyed that one. Ah, oh, you got it. You got me. I do only know American. It's true. My favorite language, American. <laughs> and here we go. Who's my next foe? Giant has fallen. Oh, dude! That's gotta be the one that Jack cut off the beanstalk. I know what's, I never destroyed city! <laughs> Go back to the place you just were. <laughs> Doc on it. Come, aggro. We ride again. <laughs> uh, people who don't live in America do not know American. Alright, yeah, we gotta pull up our pants a little bit more. Aggro runs to the top of the stairs, so that way he can conveniently run very slowly to the bottom of the stairs. Alright, where are we going now? Are we going back across the same dumb old bridge? Or are we going across a different dumb old bridge? Alright. I think maybe this is the city that I had seen earlier, beyond the desert. <laughs> I think we all know a few people who need to pull up their pants. Either figuratively or literally. <laughs> Aggro! What have I told you about randomly running in zigzag patterns? <laughs> you almost threw us in the gorge! <laughs> Come on, run. Look, Agro, I know you're hungry and thirsty. If I could give you food and water, I would. <laughs> but the game doesn't let me. The game thinks that living creatures don't need food or water. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. I, I probably should have the map a little bit... I should probably know the map a little bit better, but... I'm really bad with directions, period. Like... In the in real life, I have to drive a route, like, ten times before I actually know it. And even then, I probably will still use the GPS just as a safety! I mean, there is something pretty cool about a man riding through distant lands on a horse. Don't get me wrong. Oh, no! It's the freaking forest that Aggro will not move through. Aggro! Move your butt! My gosh, you are so slow. Aggro! Forget this. I can walk faster than this. Okay. Wait, this is the forest glade where there's a, a just a cliff top, so... Alright, well, let's... Let's keep going! I'm not sure if I've ever done a jump slash before. That was fun. <laughs> Agro. <laughs> the dike. <laughs> if if the main character in this, the main character in this is basically Dumbledore from the books, and I'm Dumbledore from the movies. Yeah. The guy, the guy in this is just like yeah. Agro, and I'm like Agro, move. <laughs> Okay, I, hang on. I've already been this way before. I thought maybe it was going to take me to an old abandoned city, but... It's telling me to go this way, so... I'll go this way! 
But this is where I fought the water guy. With the teeth on the top of his head. Which I think is a very weird design choice, but... Uh, I can't help but feel like those teeth wouldn't function very well as teeth. Unless, like, the top half of his head got torn off, but then in that case, how the heck is he still alive? Oh wait, he's not! Because I killed him. <laughs> Remember guys, if you travel south for long enough, eventually you'll end up in the north. Yeah, see here, it's like the ruins of... Well, this definitely seems like the ruins of a city. But then again, a lot of this seems like the ruins of the city. The first three quarters of this game was go to the lake. Now it's go to the city. Yeah, it's telling me to go for... Let me guess. It's like, oh no, you're supposed to go around a wall. Idiot. Actually, you know, maybe we should check the map. Oh, no. You just know they wanted me to go around, didn't they? I mean, I'm here, I'll go all the way back, but I'm pretty sure this is just... Oh, duck on it, and I have to swim back there, too, at, like, a quarter of a mile per minute. Or not per minute. A quarter... That would be impressive, a quarter mile a minute. A quarter of a mile per, like, year. I've been working as a sailor. Five to twenty years a whaler. But not whaler isn't the kind of guy who, like, hunts whales. No, whaler isn't the kind of guy who complains about the tiniest veins all the time. Everyone hates working with me. <laughs> and yet, we're basically no closer here now than we were when we started. Yeah, I have to imagine that this is not the way that the game wants me to go, even though it's telling me to go this way. I already killed the guy in here. Have I been taking my medicine? I don't take medicine. I am perfectly healthy in every way, thank you very much. And I am very grateful to this. And you know why I'm very healthy? Because I every day as a kid, I always took my Flintstones vitamin. Okay, yeah, yeah, whoops. Okay. I'm going to quick warp back to the ruins at the beginning, because I am in a dead end and very far away, so. <laughs> Guys, I actually haven't been working as a sailor. I was lying. I, I gotta come clean. I was just singing the psalm, because, you know, it was a psalm. Why does Agro sometimes spawn inside the temple and sometimes he's just like, I'm gonna climb up the stairs, Rero! Yeah. My headcanon is Agro can talk and yeah. sounds like Scooby Doo. Yeah. Don't judge me! Alright, we, we ride! <laughs> That's good. Hey, you can't say that you were a sailor. It's okay. I got approved by a guy in the Navy. <laughs> One of the stats is like, how many hawks have you ridden? Which is weird. Okay, hang on. Before we go any further. Okay, yes, this is the way we want to go. We just don't want to go on the second bridge. <laughs> <laughs> Aggro can go straight or make, like, a 180-degree turn. And there's not really anything in between. <laughs> I've never actually been out to sea. I've been out on a lake, and that's really fun. I have not been out to sea on a boat, though. So, I don't know if I would get seasick. On the one hand, probably not, because I got kind of an iron stomach. But on the other hand, I do get car sick if I uh, read in the car. So, could go either way. 
It's it's true, Sonic, and it's up to us to keep it that way. <laughs> For there are forces that would seek to destroy us. <laughs> oh, that's not that's not ground. <laughs> Agro. <laughs> This is where, if I was a talented artist, I would make a new emote for my channel, which is aggro with, like, a stupid look on his face. Unfortunately, I have no talent in the arts, and so I cannot make such a thing happen. And here we go. <laughs> We haven't gotten, like, a side... Oh, yeah, okay. That's pretty cinematic. That's pretty cinematic. Run, aggro, my faithful steed. We ride to save the woman we love, I assume. Maybe it's our sister, actually. I don't know. We save random girl that we brought to the temple. Aha, yeah, here we go. Oh, ho, 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 it could be the Desert Colossus. Okay, aggro. We run up the top of the hill, and then we do a dramatic jump to the ground. Here we go. One, two, three, touch out! Oh, dude, that was awesome. Aggro, that was really cool. That's the kind of horse I want you to be. <laughs> it's almost like it was destiny. <laughs> Thank you, Aggro. See? I'm nice to Aggro when he's good. So, like, once a stream, maybe. Okay, yeah, yeah, this was the ruined city I found when I was desperately searching for the Tooth guy. I figured you were trying to say Darude Sandstorm, not Daratude. Daratude sounds like a weird, like, hippie surfer who's hosting a surfing contest back in the 1960s. Daratude surf competition, man. Winner gets a new surfboard. Signed by the legendary Daratude himself. Alright! I don't think Agro is following us. But just in case you can. Oh, look at that. It's so pretty. It's also still somewhat intact. Alright. We pull up our pants. We go get the atmospheric scene. And hopefully it triggers a Colossus cutscene right about now. Yes! I didn't even know that was coming. That was just... It seemed like that was going to happen. Oh! This might be the really big guy you were uh, asking about. Oh, dude! This guy looks so boss! <laughs> Literally, because he's a boss. Hi! You know, some boys have been pestering me at school. Can I hire you as protection? Wait, this is like a bigger version of the first guy. I loved the first guy. Okay. What? The? Wow, that was magic! <laughs> the ground resealed itself as soon as he took a step. Okay, well clearly I can't just climb him up right now, so... Maybe I can climb up something over here. No, come on, I think you should be able to climb up that. Wow, he's fast. Makes sense, he takes really big steps. Let's follow him and see where he goes. Let's see how far away he goes. Bro, you better not you better not hurt Agro. He actually was good to me for once. Okay, I'm small. It's gonna be hard for him to see me. And let's try to keep it that way. <laughs> I mean, if the bo the boss needs to see me. 
Until the boss can see me, I'm safe. But once he sees me, he can just run over here and just smash me like a bug. Why can't you climb up that, dude? Come on! Wow! <laughs> that is definitely more intense than anything I have done. Okay, I... Uh, does he see me? Or is he just gonna walk past? Uh, do you see me? He's staring right at me, so actually he might see me. Can I grab onto your club? Hi. Uh, are you gonna do anything? Or are you just gonna look at me? Aha, I see. Ow! He's like, ah, I crush you with my foot. Hey, dude, uh, I just want to be your friend. I truly don't mean, actually, well, I kind of, maybe do a little bit. Aha! Oh, wait, do that again. Do it again. I dare you. You're too, what are you, chicken? Oh, he's a chicken. Let's fix that with a controlled shock. A hi. what I'm looking for. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I just needed a little boost. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. You're a homie. At some point, Nimrod should just be like, bro, you can figure this out yourself, okay? It's the last Colossus. <laughs> Say it exactly like that. Okay, now maybe if we get his attention... Again. Hey, dude, your mom is so fat that everybody loved her and there was nothing funny about her at all. <laughs> what you gonna do to me when I'm on this level, dude? You can't step on me up here. What a chicken. <laughs> Yeah, you're just a big chicken. Shoot him in the stomach. He does not even care. He's just looking at me like, why are you doing this? Why? Bro, you've got a club. Use it. Well, he did use it. I don't think I can use that to my advantage at all, but... Waka waka! Okay, maybe... Huh. I feel like I need him to damage part of this... area I'm on. And oh, hi! Beep! Beep! On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your pain? Okay, what are you going to do with that? See, you're you're all talk, bro. You're all show and no substance. I can only just keep sniping you in the head with arrows, and eventually I will kill you. Come on, dude. Do something. I've actually dealt a decent chunk of damage to him just by shooting him in the head. Aha! See? I was waiting for something like that to happen. Thank you, sir. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to find much higher ground, but I gotta, I gotta get there steadily, Nimrod. Okay. Um. Wait, there was a ramp to get up here. Uh, whoops. Oh well. Hey, Tommy. 
I went to your house when I trick-or-treated and you gave me out Almond Joys. I got a bone to pick with you. Almond Joys are the second worst candy bar. They are a little bit better than Paydays, but that's also a very low bar to go over, Brody. Bro, it's not my fault that you're giving out Almond Joys. <laughs> Almond Joys suck! <laughs> it's like, mmm, you know what's great? Almonds and coconut. Yum. Like, no. <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> if you like Almond Joys, good for you. But if I get an Almond Joy at, at Trick or Treat, I'm, I'm, a, I'm quite disappointed. Nintendo Addict, I'm glad you enjoy Almond Joys. If I ever get any, I will share them with you. <laughs> oh, do that again. We can all agree, though, that paydays are really bad, right? I just don't like the taste of coconut. Toasted coconut is good. Raw coconut, I can't get behind. Okay, now we wait patiently for him to walk this way. Just like that song said. Well, Proxima, paydays are an American candy. And you've got better stuff over in the UK. You've got things like Mars Bars and Terry's Chocolate Orange, which are, like, amazing. Uh, paydays are basically just peanuts with, like, Kind of, sort of, caramel connecting them. Oh, hi, 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 oh, hey, boo-boo, hey, boo-boo. <laughs> I did not expect him to just... Okay, uh, how are we not dead? How the cuss are we not dead? <laughs> there is no reason we should be alive right now. <laughs> I wonder if his only weak spot is on the top of his head. Oh, he... I feel like his mask is making him look even angrier now. M&Ms are kind of like... <laughs> the gateway candy. It's like what you give children to kind of give them an inter interest in what candy is like. Uh, wait, uh... Wait, that's not where I wanted to go, actually. Yeah, actually, uh, bro, I kind of need you to do that attack over here. My bad. Oh, and pix pixie sticks. Pixie sticks are also terrible. It's like, hey, how would you like flavored sugar in a straw? It's like, um, no. Can I have, like, a mini Snickers instead? I don't even really like Snickers that much, but... find its hidden by okay well I'm first I need to get back up to the top again my good man hey dude are you gonna there we go see oh pop rocks also stink Roxas likes them though Don't, oh, I just love eating straws with sugar and um, and getting the and getting the paper stuck in my mouth. Yeah, it's 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 a wonderful eating experience. Another candy bar that's not honestly not that great. Free Musketeers, like it's fine. It kind of does the bare minimum job that you need for a candy bar, but like. Did I actually destroy his the weak point on his head just by sniping it with arrows? I think I did. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no. 
Maybe just a tad. Oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. Geronimo! Oh, shoot! <laughs> Don't worry, guys. We grabbed onto his underwear. We're, we're good. <laughs> this is exactly what we needed. We just needed to grab onto his underwear. Okay, well, actually, maybe we needed a little bit more than this. Actually, maybe this is a really bad idea. Okay. Actually, mm. okay. Uh, actually, maybe maybe this is maybe this isn't gonna work out as well as I thought. Okay, hey hey hey, buddy, hey buddy, hey buddy, 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 can you please, can you please sidle over here? Please and thank you. God bless! Nailed it. Hey, doofus! Oh my gosh, is his weak... Wait, is his weak point... Oh my gosh. The weak point on him are his nipples. Wow. Well, they make perfect targets, I guess. <laughs> if you play on easy mode... Nimrod actually gives you very clear directions. He's just like, dude, shoot him in the nipple, all right? All right, let's try grabbing onto him again. This time, we don't land too far down. Okay. I want to lure him over here, but at the same time, I also don't want him to use his club to just be like, no more arch for you. Because I think that that would be kind of bad. But I have a feeling that when... Uh, no! Oh, he's, he's going to knock it down! I don't... You know, I don't think that that's... Uh, oh, thank goodness, I'm still high up here. I don't think that's actually how... Oh, no, it is! Oh, wait, I see, because now he's actually... Got, oh, yes, this is good. Geronimo! Okay, now we gotta... Oh, yeah. oh wait, he does still have... I'm trying, dude, but it's kind of hard to climb on him when he's uh, shaking, shaking, shaking. Like he's out of bacon. He does look a little bit like King Kong. Okay, I'm not getting any opportunity to stab him. I'm going to need to climb back up to the top of his head, I think. I, I thought I actually got rid of all of his HP on the top of his head, but... Alright, well, first step, we got to get rid of... Got to get rid of his big weak point up here. That's a gotta. Ooh! Critical hit! Ooh! Wait, is this his only weak point? Oh, brutal. Okay, no, that's... Okay. So that's it for that weak point. I think the rest of it is on his chest, then. Yeah, because we can't... We can't climb down on his back. Yeah, he could just grab us with his hand, but he really doesn't want to let go of his club. And he doesn't know how to use his other hand. 
Remember, he's big. That doesn't mean he goes to the library all the time. Okay, that didn't do any damage. Surely this will do it. Come on. Come on! Ah, oh, stop shaking! Just take it like a man. Okay, that didn't do any damage either. Okay, I'm just stabbing him with Reckless Abandon, and I don't think it's working. That's weird! I was shooting him in the chest, and it was dealing damage. Okay, hey, bro. I'm running out a little bit on my grip meter. I would really appreciate it if you could get a grip and let me get a grip. Oh, yeah. See, that's exactly what I wanted you to do. Okay, well, actually, not quite that. Come on. No, 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 no. I don't want to run out of grip. Come on. Ah, ah! Excuse me, sir. It's rude that you're trying to shake me off while I'm trying to kill you. Didn't mommy ever teach you manners? Bro, Nimrod, you're not helping. <laughs> I'll do it myself. There we go. Oh! That's gonna hurt! Ouch! He dropped his club. Oh, but that didn't actually, like, kill him. So I gotta climb back up again. Unless he's gonna grab me. It looked like he sprained his ankle or something. He's like, oh! I just stomped on my ankle that I sprained. That's not good. Okay, this guy's taking a while to beat, but it's a cool fight. They, they really... Okay, they definitely ramped up the quality of the boss fights at the end. For sure. Hey, buddy, this is gonna really hurt, but, um... Skadoosh. Ooh! Actually, hats off to him. That did no damage to him. If you can only armor a couple of places, armoring up the crotch is probably a good idea. Alright. We climb up high again. We jump on him again, and we stab him in the armpit, and we should be able to go home, have hot cocoa, and then fight the 16th Colossus. Hey, Tony! Hey, Tony! I like the things you do. Hey, Tony! <laughs> oh, that was close. Frosted Flakes! They're more than good! They're great! <laughs> hey, Tony! Are you gonna sh Are you gonna, like, stomp on me or what, bro? Don't be tantalizing. Thank you. Haba daba daba. Climb up more and more and more and more. 
We gotta see just what's in store, in store. I went to the store the other day and they didn't have any green apples and it made me very upset. I love green apples. I want to have one every day. Hey, dummy! Are you the same gorilla that made the terrible knockoff brand Frosted Flakes where he was just gorging himself on cheap knockoff brand cereal on the front of it? Because those sucked. You're no substitute for Tony the Tiger! Alright, let's go back down there and stab him in the... He literally has a crack on his arm. I don't know how that got there, but... I'm gonna make it bigger. <laughs> Don't be a tease, bro. Is that not doing anything else? I guess he already dropped his club. But it's still glowing blue. Does he have one like that on his other side that I can also stab? Also, Nimrod's not telling me to find his hidden weak point anymore. Maybe it's because I already found it. Maybe it's because Nimrod's just like, Bro, are you stupid? You can figure this out, okay? You're 26 years old and people half your age can figure this out. Oh wait, there's no hair on this part! Wait, no, there is! There's a tiny little bit of hair over here. Just the tiniest bit. If he would stop swinging his arm around... What the heck? Stop swinging your arm around like a little butt. Um... Objection, Your Honor. Maybe I'm missing something. Well, no, not maybe. I definitely am. Okay, I'm confused. Where's his final weak point? I was stabbing him on his cracked arm and it wasn't doing anything. Will you just stomp the platform already? He thinks he's clever by stabbing the, uh, the platform I didn't think he was going to. By stomping on it. I'm the one who stabbed been I'm dabbling. I'm stabbling. Okay. Nimrod, if you have maybe a better hint. Maybe we could give it. Maybe we could get it. Understand. Where's his final freaking weak spot? Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> yeah, this is not working out. Oh, no. Okay, it's gotta involve the crack. It's gotta involve his cracked arm. Why else would they put that there?
Man, he's being annoying, though. I wish he wasn't being annoying. Come on, come on. I'm not even moving. Are you kidding me? He wasn't moving. I was desperately telling him to move on the arm, and he just wasn't doing it. No, stop moving. You don't see me. He dropped his club. Is his club still around somewhere? Or did his club just disintegrate at this point? It appears his club disintegrated. Oh, hey, he's smashing me with his fist now. That's a new one on me. My controller was vibrating. Or he was, like, talking to me. Ow! It's in the palm of his hand. Okay. How do I get to grab onto the palm of his hand, though? Because he keeps curling his fingers around his hand. And even shooting with the bow and arrow doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, somehow I grabbed onto it this time. Oh, that's not good. So we stabbed him in the brain multiple times, but it wasn't until we stabbed him in the palm of his hand that he actually died. Oh no! <laughs> I wanted to just end that by saying, Agro! It didn't happen. Is it my imagination, or are we getting more and more of a sickly shade of white every time we beat a boss? His heart was on his sleeve. <laughs> Man, I guess I knew that boss like it was the palm of my hand. <laughs> Man, I gotta hand it to this guy. Oh, 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 oh. Man, that boss slaps.